This is my uh, over Unity uh, system. Produces uh, free electricity, and uh, just wanted to walk you through it. Uh, I have my uh, power cord here, my incoming power, and a meter to show how much power is uh, being consumed by the system. And then uh, I got my controller here that uh, converts my two-phase power to three-phase, and also allows me to adjust my uh, RPM on my drive motor. I got an on-off toggle switch wired in here, my three-phase drive motor with a uh, rotor mounted on it with uh, lower earth magnets. And, and then I have a same type uh, rotor mounted on my alternator. Uh, they're not in physical contact with each other, just magnetically uh, one influences the next. And uh, my alternator here produces my DC power, and that's connected to my uh, bat cap. Uh, it's not a battery, it's not an ultra capacitor, it's a combination of both, so it's called a bat cap. And, uh, just acts as a dampener between my alternator and my inverter. I don't really use it for storage power, to store power particularly. Um, I use it instead of a lead acid battery because uh, I only need one of these where I'd need quite a few lead acid batteries to do the same thing. Uh, I have my inverter here, 2000 watt inverter, and I have connected to that uh, 300 watt light bulb with another inline meter here to show how many watts are coming out of the system. So uh, let's turn it on, see how it works here. Click the switch. You can see the uh, drive motor coming up to speed, and um, it is uh, in turn magnetically spinning the alternator uh, rotor. And as it comes up to speed here, I'll take my uh, tester here and see what RPM we've reached. And we're up to speed about now, and we're at 1,681 RPM. And we're producing 11.82 uh, volts and consuming, it looks like, about 109 watts. So we got 109 watts going in. And if I turn on my inverter, my light bulb goes on. And we are now, see how much we're consuming. We're uh, we're consuming 252 watts, so 113 watts for now going in, and 257 watts going out, and we're maintaining 11.34 volts, and so we have a uh, over unity here of about 144 watts, and this will run all day long just like this. I'm still testing the system and perfecting it, but right now I do have over unity and uh, a workable system here. So I just need to uh, increase its capacity and output and I can uh, run whatever I'd like. So that's the system. I'm going to show it to you, how it works. We shut it off here. You can see that the uh, voltage drop and now we're just bleeding power off the bat cap and if I wait here a minute or so we'll drain all the power to the point where the alarm will go off on my inverter and tell me that uh, I'm at too low a wide, uh, voltage to, to operate the inverter. So uh, that's the system and uh, thank you for looking.